The King, Queen and other members of the royal family have gathered this morning for their traditional Christmas celebration in Sandringham. Nine Zero correspondent Edward Godfrey has more. In keeping with tradition, the royal family has celebrated Christmas here in Norfolk, about three hours north of central London. King Charles and Queen Camilla leading the way for the morning walk to church, waving as they were greeted by a group of keen royal watchers gathered near the estate. The King and Queen complimenting each other in shades of camel, followed by son William and Kate and younger members of the family, including their three children. Most dressed in navy blue, Louis in tartan pants and Charlotte in a green coat. Other royals in attendance for the service, Princess Anne and Prince Edward, and Prince Andrew, who's no longer part of frontline duties, also there, accompanied by ex-wife Sarah Ferguson for the first time in many years. This is a long-standing tradition for the royal family, but just the second since the passing of Queen Elizabeth. Most Christmases during her reign spent here in the north, the family a show of unity as they left St Mary Magdalene Church, some given flowers by well-wishers, Fergie chatting casually with a policeman. As they headed to Sandringham House for Christmas lunch, a new photo released by the Prince and Princess of Wales. A beautiful black and white portrait of George, Charlotte and Louis together on an antique bench seat. Captioned with, wishing everyone a very Merry Christmas from our family to yours. The King is expected to spend the coming days here before travelling to Scotland. Meantime, King Charles has made his first traditional Christmas speech since he was crowned, urging people to protect each other. The King also touched on an issue very close to his heart, that's climate change, the monarch acknowledging the growing awareness of the need to protect the planet. We care for the earth for the sake of our children's children. During my lifetime, I've been so pleased to see a growing awareness of how we must protect the earth and our natural world as the one home which we all share. I find great inspiration now from the way so many people recognise this. In the broadcast, the King was seen standing next to a living Christmas tree that, we're told, would be replanted after the broadcast. Hey there today, fans. Sarah and... <laughs> What's my name again? Oh my Carl. <laughs> hey, thanks for watching our YouTube <laughs> channel, though. Subscribe now for more news, special reports and amazing Aussie stories. And Carl misbehaving, Whoa, of course. That never happens. Always happens. What's she talking about?